Oh boy, where do I begin? Well, first of all, let me begin by saying that this is a screenshot from the from a post on well, it says eight hours ago, but that was actually more like this is more like the other night from from the Star official Star Wars Facebook page. And my first thought was, oh god, I am so fucking pissed. I'm done. Okay? As you can tell there, I made the angry reaction. Because, let me tell you. Personally, I hate being called racist. Okay? People who know me know that I am the least racist person I'll ever meet. I'm going to make a video about that another time. Anyway, what I'm talking about here is... <clears throat> Lately, Disney has gone out of their way to basically ruin existing franchises by doing their own shit. And I'm like, when I saw this, I basically made a post saying, that's it. I'm officially checking out of Disney Star Wars. What they did is they created a new character, Reva, cast a female, well, a new character, her name is Reva, she's a female character, <clears throat> cast a, uh, a black woman in the role, Moses Ingram, and just, oh my god, this is just ridiculous. And the moment I saw this, I'm like, oh my god. I can imagine people are going to be all over this. And I've already seen posts by Jeremy from Geeks and Gamers, as a few over his baby face, Ryan Kennel. I think Drunk 3 made a video about this, but they all they're all talking about how the, the same post is on is on their oh, is on is on their Twitter page as well. And I'm like, they are really, they're really alienating us old, old, school, old uh, Disney fans. I mean, us old Star Wars fans. <sighs> Disney do us, Disney here, take, take a note from other companies. Stop doing this. You're ruining it. You're, 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 you're pandering to a small minority and other companies have done this and they're not making money. In fact, they're losing money. I mean, look, look, what okay. Netflix, they were losing subscribers based on their, uh, based on their original content being so woke and shitty. Paramount. Was it Paramount? Is it Paramount? Well, it's it's. I think it's Paramount, but they have the highest grossing movie of this holiday weekend. Top Gun Maverick. And all that was was just a exact a a a, tr a real uh, sequel to an old movie. And what happened? They didn't go woke. They didn't do. They didn't do the whole. They didn't do what you guys normally do. Take a note from these guys, from these people. Stop this shit. And do what's and stop pandering to the wrong crowd. Also, stop calling people racist. Also, I think that, personally, I think this this this. To me, this screams Lucasfilm Story Group. People like Pablo Hidalgo. Yeah. At this point, I am going to quote what Jeremy said in his video. Fuck Lucasfilm. I'm done. Just let me... Let me enjoy what I used to love back before you guys bought it. 
Well, I was saying thank you all for watching. Take care of yourselves.